Good afternoon, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and Google+. Plus. This is Rich again, back for your second video blog of the day for Monday, August 8th, 2016, around 5.20 in the afternoon in Berwick, Massachusetts. A uh, nice day out, a little bit of a breeze, mid-80s, and comfortable humidity in the 50s, so it's comfortable. Tomorrow, it's going to be the same thing with low humidity, but beginning Wednesday, temperature goes up again to the 90s, and humidity's oppressive. Could be a heat wave, but chances of thunder showers. Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, and possibly through the weekend. Some news to report. The Cleveland Browns have named RG3 their starting quarterback. This is the Browns' maybe like 17th, 18th starting quarterback since they rejoined the NFL in 1999. Hopefully, T um, RG3 could get his career back on track. It's Happy International Cat Day, meow, and the WWE has fired Joey Styles. Oh my God! Joey Styles, for the past several years, was the vice president of media of the WWE. He was in charge of the website. He also appeared on WWE 24/7, Classics on Demand, and most recently the WWE Network. <laughs> The, the reason that Joey Styles was fired, they don't know. They didn't say. Maybe his contract wasn't renewed or he did something wrong. The WWE wishes Joey Styles good luck in his future endeavors. And that's about it on the news. My second video blog subject of the day is the former digital over-the-air television network PB. J. PBJ is peanut butter and jelly, so they, they called it PBJ, and it it was a focus of children's programming. Some classic cartoons and some live action kid shows. It lasted from August 2011 through March of 2016 this past year. And it was co-owned by Lucan Communications, which owns Retro TV and Tough TV, and the DreamWorks Classics Studios, which which included like classic cartoons and some of the p programming that was on PBJ for the four and a half years it was on the air was classic cartoons like He-Man and the Masters of, uh, of the Universe. I have the power. Uh, she was... Uh, Princess of Power, Mr. Magoo, Roadhog, do 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 and they also had um, Fat Albert and Cosby Kids. Hey, hey, hey! It's Fat Albert! And several other classic cartoons, including like the 1996 ver version of Richie Rich. And also, they had um, classic kids programming on there, including Skippy the Bush Kangaroo, Shazam! Sabrina, Sabrina, the teenage witch from the 1970s. They also showed the Long Ranger, Hi Ho Silver, the New Adventures of Zorro, and the Adventures of Black Beauty. They usually showed the cartoons early in the day and in prime time, and in the middle of the day and the late night. They showed the live action. Um, um, television, kids' television shows. 
But the problem that PBJ had, they could not get enough clearances by like digital over the air networks and they had to be on low powered television stations. PBJ was not shown in Boston area at all. And a lot of um, people wanted a classic cartoon network to include on digital over the air television network from the Hannah Barbera properties. Uh, all of the Hannah Barbera cartoons, which include Superman, Batman, Super Friends, Flinch, Flintstones, Jetson, Shirt, Shirt Tales, Haunt, Haunt, Fui, Scooby Doo, and so many others. But that Hannah Barbera is locked up on a long term contract with the Cartoon Network, and there was no way that the Cartoon Network was going to sublease it to PBJ. Also, Lucan Communications was losing a lot of money on this venture, and so was DreamWorks, and they had it shut down earlier this year. There were only 19 affiliates for PBJ when it went off the air a few months ago, and it was very sad to say the least, because I, they, they, there could be a market, a market out there for classic t kids programming, for like cartoons and live action sh shows, and you know the DreamWorks Classics has a decent amount of cl classic cartoons in their library, but I think a lot of like television stations really want um, the Hanna Barbera. Um, cartoon library for like digital over the air network but that's not gonna happen my friends so they, they might not be uh, like a digital over the air classic cartoon channel anytime soon but like PBJ gave it it, it, it all and that's about it on PBJ and the third and final few blogs coming up tonight and it's gonna be about my personality profile tonight's personality profile is about Former Major League Baseball pitcher Whitey Ford who pitched for the New York Yankees, chairman of the board. Keep calm, everybody. I'm a Julie Brennan guy. Molly Rose Blood, WCCO, Oxen has nice legs. Elizabeth Hot, so, so stunning. She's the best. Amy Sweezy's awesome. She's awesome, Amy. Linda Church of WPIX, Channel 11, New York, has nice legs. And in the words of Sean Lucci, out. See you later. Bye now.